I hope the next car runs you all over. Oh, don't engage with them. They'll soon get bored. Or die of old age. Yeah, if you don't shoot us first. If he doesn't, I will. Try it. Oh, Dad, this isn't helping. Did you hear that? He threatened us. All right, I've had enough of this. You better stop now. I don't like your tone. We're not stopping till everyone knows what you're really like. You made our point. Maybe we should go. Well, I've hardly started. Lion scum. It's OK, don't worry. I'm not bluffing. If you don't leave right now, I'm calling the police. Do it. I might handcuff myself to the gate. We're going now. Please, Diane. Fine. But I'll be back every day. You really think you're a match for me? I'll get the whole village involved. It won't be hard. They all hate you. We'll drive you out. I'm not going anywhere. And don't forget, I own the house where you and your family live. I could be the one driving you out. Now you've gone too far. We pay our rent. And if you try and throw us out, we'll... 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 We'll squat. That's what we'll do. We'll be squatters. See how you like that. Now you're talking. I can only be pushed so far. He can't throw us out. You'd be surprised what I can do when I put my mind to it. Who called the cavalry? Well, I wondered when you'd show up. Brought your little placard, have you? No offence, but this is not the best idea you've ever had. I didn't see you coming up with anything better. You're right, but this... Freezing to death with a few hand-painted signs. This is never going to work. It's not worth losing your home over. You threatened to evict her. She's a very bad tenant. And you're a very sad man. If you people haven't moved in five minutes, I'm calling my solicitor and starting the ball rolling. Do I make myself clear? You can't intimidate us. You're not going to be homeless. This is all down to you. I should never have trusted you. Just look at what you've done to Diane. You know, I thought you'd be useful, but all you've done is screw everything up. How dare you speak to her like that? You're worthless. Complete waste of time. I'm sorry. You ready? Well, where are you going? Mum's taking me out for pizza. Well, I thought we were having a family meal. Well, I never agreed to that. Yeah, but Rebecca's cooking. No, she's not. She's not even there. We don't know where she is. Shopping. So she says. I mean, how do we know we can trust her? She's trying to make amends. You could take a leaf out of her book. I don't care what she does. I'm not having any part of it. Chrissy, please. No, so, you and Rebecca can have your cosy dinner and welcome her back to the fold. We've got better things to do. Come on, Lucky. Hey! Are you all right? Yeah. But she won't be. No, 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 don't. We need to call the police. No, I, uh, I don't want them involved. Uh, we don't exactly come off as the good guys. Well, she's gone too far this time. I mean, that, that nearly hit Lucky. Let me handle it. Uh, I'll call someone to fix the window and... and then we can decide what to do, right? Are we just gonna let her get away with it? No. 